Anytime you travel and you want to see the difference in culture in different countries, visit their market. So here in Namibia, I got a chance to visit the Oshetu market, Soweto market and Okiangawa market. So I can have a good understanding of what Namibia culture is when it comes to their food and their dresses. What do you love the most about Namibia? About Namibia? Yeah. I, I don't love it. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming to you from Vinku and meet my today's chauffeur. Say hi. Hi guys. Yeah, she's called Traveling with Queen and she is taking me outside the life that is like admirable and fancy and poshish to the real Namibian sort of lifestyle. We are heading to Katutura and I can't wait to see what's there and the difference, the beauty of people and where life is happening. So she also has a YouTube channel that you should definitely check it out. I'm going to leave the link in the description box. She's been so good to me, so you better go follow her, okay? So stick around, hit the like button, and let's head over and see the beauty of Namibia. To Katutura, we are heading on this direction. So we have made it to Oshetu Community Market and I can't wait to explore together with you guys so you can see what Oshetu Market has to offer. In Oshetu Community Market here, here is where you can get Okapana. Mm -hmm. Like we used to buy our dry meat here. Mm -hmm. As we go inside, you're going to find more okay. of the meat I'm talking about yeah. and a lot of traditional food. Okay. So let's go, let's go. It's gonna be fun. I'm excited already when they talk about meat. I'm oh, present. <laughs> so we are inside the market. And the smell, I can already feel like the smell of some food. Sort of more like meat that I like. So let's come in and explore together. Yeah, so what I like this one? Yeah, this one is the fish. It's a dry fish. Yeah, yeah, oh, this yeah. is dry. This like someone can eat this? Yeah. Oh my goodness. This is a dry fish. Yeah. This is a dry fish. Nice. Yeah. This and this one, mm -hmm. we call it a bellies. Mm -hmm. There's a white bellies. Yeah. Yeah, most you can find it like the northern part of Namibia. Mm -hmm. But so this is people eat as a snack or what? Yeah, yeah, they eat as a snack. Okay. Yeah. I can't wait to try all of these things, <laughs> you know. Oh my goodness. And yeah. this one? Uh -huh. Yeah, it's beans. These are beans. Do you cook it or you eat it? Yeah, like we that? cook it, then you eat it cooked. Okay. okay. You can also dry it. Yeah. Then once it's dry, it uh -huh. will be like this one. Ah, this one, great. Yeah, this great, one. great. Ah, I get and it. This one, uh -huh. hope it's a. Uh, this fat. This is. Cow, yeah, it's cow like, fat? Yeah, cow fat. Not cow fat, but it's like. Um, it produces like, like a butter. Mm. Like it produces like. From the milk, once you milk the kettle, yeah. then they have to you to to make it like that. It's like to make it and they, they milk the milk, then they shake it. Mm -hmm. After they shake it, they they want the fat to come like in front of the the milk. Then once it is come, then they remove it. Mm -hmm. They put it in the pot. They cook it. Then they put it in their bottle like this. Ah, you can nice. use it with, you can eat it with any type of food. Mm -hmm. And it's smelling so good in food. Okay. Mm -hmm. So let's try. Okay. okay yeah. What about that one? I'm curious uh, about this that one. one. Yeah. This one is a palm. Oh, one that is, is a, a palm. It's a palm fruit. It came from a palm tree. Mm. Most of this palm tree you can find it in the northern part of Namibia. Yeah. Really, unlike in Namibia, I mean in, in Vindu, mm -hmm. it's not really, but in the northern part of Namibia, there's most of this palm tree. Okay, nice. Yeah. It's a dry cabbage, I mean dry uh, spinach. Oh, this is dried spinach? Yeah, it's dried spinach. So you buy this and you eat it with pub? Yeah, you eat it with pub like this. You can buy it, then you, I mean, you put it in water. Yeah. You, to be soft, you put it in water. I'm not gonna say. 
you soak it yeah you soak it in water yeah and then, and you then later you... on you cook it it's yeah. just soft as a uh, oh nice as, nice. as spinach great and this one is honey honey yeah, yeah. this is honey yeah, this is, is honey. there a high production of honey yeah okay yeah and this one do you know what it is no this is a uh, mopani warm what people eat worms here yeah. this is oh warm. my goodness this is a <laughs> This is mopani worm. Oh my goodness! Yes. They, they, are, they, what, they have two types of mopani yeah. worm. These are the black one. Mm -hmm. and we call it, this is a white mopani worm. Oh my but normally goodness! Normally they are green. From if they are fresh, they are green. Yeah. But if they die, they become yellow. <laughs> Guys, I can't stop laughing. She's telling me the worms has like vitamins and protein. Yeah, all the nutrition. Is Let me warm. know in the comment section if you want to see me try eating worms. <laughs> There are actually like two different types of worms, so that should be interesting, okay? <laughs> Let me know in the comment section below. To make a pup. Yes, to make a pup. So yeah. that is maize flour. It's not a maize flour. It's not maize. No, it's mahango. Mahango. Mahango millet. Okay, like, millet. Okay. Yeah, it's a mahango it. millet, yeah. The thing is, when she told me we are coming to the market, I was like, this is the same thing you know, until I am surprised. We have not even gone far from the market and I can already see all these different types of things and I can't wait to explore more. So come with us. Namibia has the most yeah. comfortable market that you can sit if by chance you're tired of doing your shopping. Guys, we met a new friend here, so hi. Hi. <laughs> what do you love the most about Namibia? About Namibia? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I don't love it. You don't love anything except, about your country? Uh, except oh, except peace. peace. Yeah, that's yeah. the only uh, you thing like I like, like about Namibia. Wow, that's great. So, for sure, for sure, I can attest this country is peaceful and I'm glad. Thank you. All right. This is good. The market is big with more of these things sold almost everywhere and food cooked. Nice. So meat is being sold on this side. Yeah. I know, right? Come here. <laughs> yeah, come in the picture. <laughs> the best. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The meat market. The meat market. We are here trying the meat. Yeah. yeah. So as you can see, the meat is being cooked and being prepared. Oh my goodness! Do you dare just speak from the plate? <laughs> oh my! <laughs> he gave me to taste. Ah, uh, he gave you to taste. Okay, yeah. okay. Whenever you came here, they were like call you. Yeah. Don't you want and give you a taste. Yeah. Then they give you a taste. Okay. Maybe. Can I get it okay? Yeah, they eat it. Yeah. Oh, eh, I can no. It's good, grilled meat. So Good. I can't wait to taste meat. If you know me, you know I love meat so so much, and I love roasted meat like this. So I can't wait to enjoy my meat. You can see our meat is getting ready, but this whole place, all the way down, people are eating meat, enjoying in this beautiful market. So time to enjoy all this. Some salt. Some meat. Now I'm going to enjoy all this without you. Bye. Ah! Right, there are firewoods being prepared that is brought. Oh, they also sell it? Yeah, they also sell it. They like this? Yeah. It might be like $50. How much is one? $50. $50 Namibian dollar. It's style like this. Yeah. You use it to cook. Okay. As you can see, the market is a big one, very busy. Everyone is buying things. Oh my goodness, just know I enjoyed my meat. On this other side, you can buy an accompaniment for the meat if you want pap. Pap is ugali. 
and then on this other side it's just small stalls where you can buy things here in the market yeah. how awesome is this saying one good thing that she loves about namibian yeah, people what i love most about namibian people they're like when you film yourself yourself they don't care yes they don't they care are, everyone was like come come, come come take me film. i'm not included <laughs> don't wanna take this picture on this yeah, page they're wow. they so friendly and kind yeah that is not something you find easily here in africa <laughs> so i'm glad namibia filming is not a big deal you can have fun while at it so Let's head over to the next destination. Heading to Soweto Market. Soweto Market. Over there. And it's gonna be a good one, I already know. As you can see, still, Namibia continues to be more developed with like traffic lights and people following them keenly. And there is a flag of Namibia. So let's head over to. We have arrived at Soweto Market and uh, traveling with Queen tells me that here I can actually find a bus to take me all the way to Zimbabwe but apparently I know the Zimbabwe border is closed so not possible but anytime it's closed because of COVID anytime you can come here those luggage are going to Zimbabwe which is pretty interesting Soweto market but uh, Soweto is in is in what is it called? Soweto is in South Africa right? No? Yeah it's in South Africa So this is more of why you guys were, were being colonized or ruled by South Africa that they even took turns to name their market or what? I, I can't tell you more in history why they really name it this market Soweto market yeah. but all I know we have Soweto in South Africa yeah. but this is it's like a peace between South Africa and Namibia ah, yeah. now I get it yeah, now, they're like, now it makes so much sense yeah. so let's go in and explore what Soweto market has in store Let's go, let's go. Thank you. <laughs> Tell me what happens here. Uh, what is happening clothes. here most of the time? Yeah. People, they are like tailor clothes mm -hmm. here. Yeah. They have some textiles. Yeah. There are trade, uh, many tailor clothes here. And they are selling some clothes. Mm -hmm. they, maybe if you want to a traditional dress, mm -hmm. you can find it here. Most of these trailers. Okay. And they, this also different um, different business. This side is for trailers. Mm -hmm. The other side is they are selling food. And the other side they are selling more Smart. traditional foods, um, traditional stuff. It is really more like a combination of most. And they are departing in small department. So ah. Yeah, they are departing in small department. Mm -hmm. There you can find it more traditional. Yeah. More can find the trailer. There you can find it food. Other side you can find the salon. If you want to do your hair, you can, you can do to it here. To women to so at the market, mm -hmm. here you can done your hair. Wow. This is the trailer. Yeah. yeah. More yeah. of beautiful yeah. clothes as beautiful you clothes. can see. Traditional. Is this traditional clothes? Yeah, like this is Vambu traditional dress, but Vambu. you can't say Vambu traditional dress because yeah. most of the people, most of the tribe, they can also wear it. You can ah. find it to Damalas, you can find it to Hereros. Everyone, let me say it's like a comfortable traditional dress, dress. for everyone. Okay, nice. In the shop. COVID-19. Yeah, before COVID-19, yeah. under the chain, there was a pool. A pool? Yeah, like, you say, a game pool? Yeah. Yeah, there was under there. So what are yeah. activity games? Yeah, like, people, I guess, like, uh, come here, come together here, come, like, enjoy, like, a funny to play a pool here. Mm -hmm. But since COVID-19 come, everything has been changed. Like, they remove the pool, so yeah. people won't be together social distancing wow okay so this is a picture of soweto market with details of everything that happens you've seen tailors and shoemakers barbers salon 
Ah, yeah. the pool. I get it now. You know when you said pool, I yeah. got water. So pool table. I get it. I get it. <laughs> pool table. <laughs> and then some place for people to chill and enjoy and tailor. And that is Soweto Market. So there's also zero injections. Yeah. Getting zero beginnings with you. This is basically what happens at Soweto Market, as you can see. Heading to see the third market and how different it is from the rest. So you say we are facing Kukuyangava Market. Kukuyangava Market. Yeah. This view is very beautiful, like the yeah, mountain. Oh my goodness. This is so good. The third market is going to be interesting because we're going to be doing crazy challenges and gonna be having fun while at it. So be sure to stick to my next video. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye for now.